Northwest took the stage during her father's recent concert in Paris to promote his album Vultures Volume 1. Hello guys, welcome once more to Celeb Gossip where we bring to you your favorite celebrity news. If it's your first time here, please kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. Thanks. The 10-year-old daughter of Kanye West and Kim Kardashian stood alongside her father and Ty Dolla Sign while performing some of their songs. Vultures is a collaborative album between 46-year-old Kanye and the Love You Better singer and is scheduled to be released in three installments over the next few months. The first volume of Vultures was released on February 9th and Akbar recently accompanied Kanye to Paris, France to celebrate the release. The concert took place at the Accor Arena, where North joined the rappers on stage as the spotlight took over. Kanye and Ty Dolla Sign, 41, wore black masks that covered their entire faces, keeping their bodies completely covered with black clothing and gloves. As for North, the 10-year-old seems to embody the modern style choice of her new stepmother, Bianca Sensori, 29. She wore a chunky puffer jacket and an all-black ensemble, which was finished off with a large fur hat that seemed to cover most of her face. Over the past few months, the former Yeezy architect has been seen wearing oversized fur hats in multiple colors. In November in Dubai, Bianca wore an oversized fur trapper and carried a beloved fur bag to a lavish fashion bash. One month later, she attended a Los Angeles Lakers game covered in an oversized leather coat and a purple fur hat. She wore a hat and similar outfit again during a shopping trip around Los Angeles with her husband in January. Although she may be known for her sheer lingerie and nude-hued looks, Bianca's association with fur hats and matching bags is now a staple. Vultures was initially scheduled to be released on December 15, 2023, but the release has been halted. A representative for Kanye told Billboard that Vultures would debut on January 12, 2024, but shortly after, the date was removed from all digital platforms. It's a big deal, an insider told the U.S. newspaper. ZTV said Kanye was putting the finishing touches on the album on December 15, 2023, when he hosted a concert at the Four Seasons Hotel in Las Vegas. The rapper hasn't released an album since 2021 when he treated fans to 27 tracks on Donda. Vultures will be Kanye's 11th studio album and follows the success of his other albums such as The College Dropout, Late Registration, Graduation, and The Life of Pablo. Vultures' tracklist will feature 18 new songs, with snippets of several already released. The lead single, Vultures, was released on November 18, 2023, creating even more excitement among fans for the release of the rest of the album. However, one line in the song caught the attention of many fans because it touched on the topic of anti-Semitism once again. Along with Ty Dolla Sign, the album features some big names, including Bad Bunny, Nicki Minaj, Young Thug, Lil Baby, Chris Brown, Quavo, Future, and Playboy Cardi.